Friends, this is Vaishnavi here. Friends, in this video, we will learn how to use star 99 hash service with TalkBack. Through this service, we can check our bank account balance and we can transfer from 1 rupee to 5000 rupees to other bank accounts. So, we don't need to have an internet connection to use this service as well as we don't need to have a smartphone to use this service. But, we need to have an M pin of our mobile banking and we need to register our mobile number with our bank account. You can use this service only through the number from which you have registered your bank account. Okay friends, you may think that we have mobile banking then why should we use this service? Friends, some of the banking applications are not accessible with TalkBack. Hence, we can use this simple service to transfer money from 1 rupee to 5000 rupees. Okay friends, I will tell you one thing clearly that we need to be a bit faster to use this service. We need to type fast otherwise it will say connection problem or MMI complete or MMI invalid something like that. So we need to type faster. So let's check it out. How does it will work? It's start 99 hash. Home. Asterisk. Star. Nine. 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 Hash. Hash. Okay. Call button. So before pressing call button, I will tell you one thing that we need to type the starting three letters of our bank name or we need to type IFSC code of our bank. So, if you are using State Bank of India's account, you can type SBI or if you are using State Bank of Hyderabad, you can type SPH. So, in this case, I am using Karur Vaisha Bank account. So, I will type KVB. Okay. So, I have double tapped on call button. So, the screen appeared. Welcome to, Welcome to NUUP. So, we have to double tap on OK button. The next screen appeared. Welcome to star 99 hash type three letters of bank short name or first four letters of bank IFSC or two digit bank numeric code of star 99 hash. Okay. Edit box. I'm quickly typing KVB. K. V. B. Send button. Okay. Double tap on send button. Here we will be providing two buttons. Cancel button and send button. We have to double tap on send button. Select option colon open parent care of ISIA close parent one dot account balance two dot mini stmt three dot send money using mmid four dot send money using ifsc six dot show mmid seven dot mpin eight dot generate otp. In this video I want to transfer money through ifsc code so I will type four. Edit box. Symbol four. So send button. I'm going to double tap on send button. Okay. Enter beneficiary ifsc open parent eleven digits close parent. Please recheck before pressing send slash reply. So here we have to type the beneficiaries IFSC code. Beneficiaries in the sense the person to whom you are sending the money. So now I will type the beneficiaries IFSC code in the provided edit box. Cancel button. Edit box. Okay. Pause button. Okay friends, I have typed the beneficiaries IFSC code. Now going to double tap on. Send button. Send button. Now it will ask you to enter beneficiaries account number. Enter beneficiary A slash C no. Please recheck before pressing send slash reply. So here also you have to type the account number of the person to whom you are sending the money. So now I will type the account number. Talkback is activated. Pause button. Okay friends, I have typed account number. Now going to double tap on. Send button. Send button. Now here it will ask you to type the amount and remarks. Enter amount and remarks open parent optional close parent separated with single space. ET 500 transfer open parent maximum amount allowed RS 5000 slash dash close parent. So now here you can type amount space only single space allowed and the remarks like transfer or rent or any single word so now i'm going to type 100 edit box one, one zero, zero, zero zero okay by giving space you can space. type anything you want delete okay now i'm going to double tap on send button edit box one, one send button so i have double tapped on send button the next screen appeared Talkback is activated. Pause button. Okay. After typing the amount, after pressing send button, here it will tell you to enter MPN. Enter MPIN open parent four digit close parent and a slash C no. Open parent last four digit close parent separated with single space X colon dash 12 44 44 44. Here you have to type your M pin and by giving single space, you have to type the last four digit of your account number. Here you have to type last four digits of your account number. After the entering and M pin. Okay. Cancel button. So let's enter M pin first. Edit box. Here I am showing you showing you the sample only. So let's sample type. keyboard. One, two, three, four. One. One, two, two three, three, four. Five. So after giving space. space, 
uh, we have to type the last four digits of our account number so now i'm going to double tap sorry i'm going to tap on four digits the last four digits of my account number D. Okay. R. Letter keyboard. F. C. Simple so keyboard. Let's type for sample. Six. Six. Four. Four. Eight. Eight. Seven. Seven. It's not the correct one. So I'm I'm showing just for sample. Now I'm going to double tap on send button. Send button. Okay. So after pressing send button, it will tell you that the amount has been processed from your account to the particular account. Now it won't show you like that because I have typed wrong number. So it will tell you invalid etc etc. So thanks for watching this video friends. If you like click on like button and if you want to give me any suggestions write in the comments and share it with your friends on Twitter, Google Plus, WhatsApp and Facebook. Thank you for watching. Zero six